Hello and welcome to Pocket Tips. In this episode, we're going to talk about why you should work on writing longer blog posts. Are you ready? Let's get it. Now, when it comes to SEO, you might have heard that writing longer blog posts is better. And when people ask me why, why that is, it, it's not the easiest explanation. And the reason why is because people think, oh, well, if I write a long blog post, who's really going to read it? And you're right. There's a lot of people who won't read a long blog post. There's a lot of people who won't read a short blog post. So you can't worry about that. Now, does it mean that if you write a longer blog post, you have a better chance of ranking for the one keyword that you want? Not necessarily, not necessarily. For pocket business, what we're looking at right now, we aim for a minimum of 1200 words, but ideally we would like each post to be 2000 plus words, which might seem like a lot of words, but there's a good reason for that. And so what we're going to do is we're over here on SEM rush and we're just going to look at pocket businesses, current SEO profile. Now pocket business has really just started getting content this month. So you're not going to see a ton here, but what we're going to do, is we're gonna look at the keywords that it's starting to rank for. And when we when we say rank for, this means the keywords in the top 100 for Google. And so we can see this is where we really started to publish content on Pocket Business and you can see it's scaling up. Now the thing I want you to pay attention to is all these keywords, all these keywords over here that are starting to rank for are all for one post. If we go to the next page, all these keywords, you know, we have one random blog post here and one more random blog post here, but everything else, that same keyword, the homepage is ranking, still same keyword. And you can see just pages upon pages. Now there's a hundred keywords on each of these pages here. So the reason why you really want to write longer piece of content. First, you want to make sure the content you write is relevant. You don't want to just make fluff. If you know, you, you get to a thousand words and you're like, okay, this topic is completely exhausted. There's really nothing else I can write that would help the reader. Then don't try to push it. That is not what we're, we're trying to say. We're saying you want to fill out that content as much as possible because there are going to be a lot of keywords that you just did not think about or that you weren't able to find or you're just not prepared for that longer pieces of content will start to rank for and they'll only rank for them because Google will be looking at these things like, oh, you know, I remember that really long blog post You kind of had some context around this one thing. So let's let's toss that up in the rankings. And so just to summarize the reason why you'd want to end up writing longer blog posts is because you really want to give your site greater odds at ranking for more of the longer tail keywords.